Hey, hi guys. Mehdi here from Mehdi's Bushcraft and Self Reliance. Uh, what I want to show you in this video is uh, a pair of trousers, or pants, as uh, the Americans would say. Um, well, we, when we're uh, in the outdoors, uh, we like to wear comfortable uh, trousers uh, that are durable, uh, that fit in the environment. So preferably green, black, camouflage, things like that. And as you know, I am uh, very fond of my uh, camouflage Dutch military uniform. But unfortunately, I can't wear it all the time and not everywhere. Like now, I'm in a city park and I don't think I, su I, I should walk around in uh, military camouflage because that will attract uh, attention of uh, people. Uh, what I've got in my new pair of pants and it was uh, a present given to me by a friend. It's uh, the Heli Hansen from the Heli Hansen workwear uh, series. Maybe you can see it here. And this is the Ashford construction pant. And it's all made of uh, Cordura fabric. It's very strong and uh, very comfortable. I have to load the cam now, so follow me. So these are the pants. It's my belt, it doesn't come with it. It's from my uh, Gilwell training. Uh, it's got several belt loops. These belt loops on the left and the right are very special because they're double and they come with velcro. As you can see, this is the belt loop where my belt goes through now. And here I can fixate another belt, which is very handy because I do have an extra belt with my axe, my knife, etc. So I don't have to walk around with it uh, in uh, urban areas and I put it on when I'm in the woods. On this side, and also on the left, there are very small loops. And for demonstration, I have put a carabiner through it. Very handy to, uh, to put on your keys or something else you don't want to lose. In front, it's got two pockets. They're deep enough to cover, or to put my hands in, keep them warm. But what's special, I can take this out still have my uh, my pockets left here and here is another pocket where I can put in tools like a knife or something else and it's the same on this side one big pouch two medium pouches and here's one big pouch one medium and two small pouches. I like this because when I'm doing some work, and of course it's designed for construction work, but also in the woods, I can put things in here and uh, keep it with me all the time. But right now I put it back and I don't feel it, I don't see it, it's perfect. When I turn around, there's a pocket here on the back closes with uh, velcro and it's big enough to put this wallet inside there's another pocket here which I can't close but still it's quite big then on the right side I can put some tools uh, in like a hammer screwdriver or my bushcraft knife something else There's a small pocket here on the left and a big pocket here I can my whole hand fits in and it's got two medium pockets and it closes with velcro. If you have to sit on your knees and you do that a lot during construction work but also in the woods you can put uh, 
how do you call them? Well, those uh, protective uh, things you can put inside and protect your knees when you sit on the on the ground. And especially in the winter, that's uh, very nice to have. The pants or the trousers are long enough, even a little bit longer than you see here. I've put it uh, to the inside. In the field or in the woods, I will put uh, an elastic band or something uh, under it and uh, wear it like military trousers. But right now, it is okay. When I'm walking in urban areas, I fit in the environment. Well guys, these are my Heli Hansen HH uh, working trousers, working pants. And uh, I've looked on the internet for the price because I was very curious. And they cost only uh, 63 euros, which is very cheap. Uh, for that price you can't buy uh, a Fjall Raven. Uh, when you're lucky you find military pants, but as I said, this is better in uh, urban environments. It's strong, solid, it's comfortable. Well, what more do you want for that price? It's, uh, it's rather cheap. So I really recommend these uh, Heli Hansen uh, working trousers. Okay, see you next time. Uh, please comment and subscribe if you haven't already done it. And see you next time. Peace out.